Millions of Americans suffer with dementia, and many are being given antipsychotic drugs to treat the behavioral and psychological symptoms, such as aggression and agitation sometimes associated with dementia. But according to a new study published in Annals of Internal Medicine, the use of antipsychotic drugs may increase the risk of death for dementia patients. This study does add to mounting concerns about the use of antipsychotic drugs to treat dementia. Dr. Sadiq Gill led the five-year study looking at health and death records of more than 27,000 people over age 66 with dementia. What we found was people who were taking the typical antipsychotic drugs were at increased risk of dying uh, and this risk seemed to emerge within a month of use and persisted for out to six months. The people who were taking conventional antipsychotics were at an even greater risk of dying. Antipsychotics are approved for conditions such as schizophrenia and mania. They are typically classified as conventional or atypical. Conventional are older established treatments such as haloperidol, thioridazine and profazine. Atypical antipsychotics are newer treatments that include drugs such as desperidone and olanzapine. I think it's very important that if you do have concerns about these drugs, uh, that either a loved one is taking them or if, if, if uh, you know, there's a patient who's taking these drugs and has concerns about their use, that they talk to their physician about the, the need to take these drugs, the ongoing need to take these drugs. On behalf of the American College of Physicians, I'm Sonia Martin.